more than half my life I've had cancer. I first had cancer in, when I was 31, thyroid cancer. I was treated with radioactive therapy and two surgeries and recovered fully. And then breast cancer hit and that uh, was very difficult. Being the caretaker can be difficult because there's not a lot you can do to help the person when they're feeling really bad. Um, I didn't know how much pain and misery was going to be for the next several months after that. I was really, really sick and couldn't um, work up any energy and completely reliant upon Bill. There was one uh, day that we looked at each other and said, we made the wrong decision to take chemo. It was very difficult those days. We uh, went through, gosh, six years or more of cancer treatment and were given a clean bill of health. I had a good five year run with no problems. I started getting super athletic again. And um, then in 2017, I could tell there were some problems with my breathing and my left arm started swelling. It was the tumor and breast cancer was back. Uh, stage four metastatic uh, to the bones and the lungs. We were pretty shaken up. You, you know what you've read and understand about metastatic breast cancer, and it's not good. I told Bill, I'm gonna go home and clean my closet and just kind of take care of matters and to try to make uh, everything easier on Bill after I passed. And then something changed. A really great radiologist did a sonogram guided biopsy that was then sent off to Tempest Labs. I didn't know next generation genomic sequencing ever existed. I was blown away. They can actually see what medicine is going to help. I already know, thanks to that test, my first, second, and third lines of defense. Before, the way cancer was fought was just your best guess. This is not a guess. They can absolutely pinpoint how they're gonna kill it. Cancer is not the death sentence that it was in years past. You have a much greater peace of mind. Yes, this is gonna work. Tempest even helped pay for anyone who couldn't afford the copay on it. They are willing to help you finance it. And I was so touched by that. I have stage four metastatic breast cancer, but I am living a wonderful life. We are very, very active. We love cycling. We also love kayaking. In many ways, we're stronger now than we've ever been in our whole lives. People say there's a light at the end of a tunnel. I don't feel like it's a tunnel. I feel like it's the light across the lake. There's going to be another sunrise. There is real hope out there.